Yeah, hello and welcome to Kimber Bushcraft. Today I'm in a Roll Forest, in a nice place I've been before. Uh, not exactly here, but other places in this area of the forest. And uh, it's a wonderful day, wonderful weather. Not a cloud in the sky and uh, not much wind. So I took my drone with me today and, uh, and I would like to share some uh, footage from that uh, with you. It's very beautiful. The leaves are beginning to uh, change color from green to, uh, to yellow and yeah it's so beautiful out here and beside that I have a stove, a new stove I would like to uh, present to you, show you and uh, use it to cook a little meal here and uh, of course my coffee yeah but now I think I'll put up the drone so you can see the area I'm in and uh, see what it is I'm looking at
uh, wasn't that beautiful. So nice to be out here, in the forest. Uh, there's spruce and uh, lots of beech trees here out here, as you can see. But now I'd like to show you the new snow I got, and I actually made a little unboxing video. You could see it now. Yeah. And uh, this is the Bond Snow Mini from Warm Bond that I'm going to make an uh, unboxing of now. Let's see what's in it. Ah, nice. Yeah, and it comes in this uh, awesome pouch that you can transport it in. Yeah, here it is. Bunch stove mini. They also make one uh, large stove. This company. Let's see this one. Yeah. And this is, I think. Put it over here. This is for. Um, Alcohol fuel. I can use it for. This, I think, it's going on the top. And uh, this too. Down here. Ah, yes. So uh, this is what you get. See inside here, and. Uh, it has a nice, nice uh, white color, and I read that this uh, ceramic uh, paint or something on, so that uh, it won't get uh, dirty and won't take the heat, uh, this color from the heat. You can see here on the bottom, it takes air in here, and uh, this is uh, some kind of rubber, uh, so it stay firm here and then this one is the burner or the bottom for collecting ashes go down here and then uh, this one on top and this one so yeah and uh, you can use uh, four kind of ways to uh, uh, light this up you can use small sticks, you can use uh, pellets, wood pellets, and uh, even charcoal. And then uh, the alcohol burner, you can put here, you can put alcohol in, and you can use it like this. And then there will be no uh, odor or no uh, smoke at all. Uh, this one can put on here too really nice and then this one is for put it on here so you stop the fire it's so awesome yeah nice little stove and uh, for comparison the solo stove that I have used a lot is a little bit bigger than that, so I think I can uh, have longer fire in this one than in this one because it takes a little more room, but not much. So uh, now I'm going to light it up for the first time out here in my video. I think you are thirsty, Cornelius. Isn't that right? It's very hot today. Yeah. There we go. Put it over here. Yeah. yeah, and as you saw in this little unboxing, my new stove here. I'm so excited to try it out.
see how it performs. Well, there's a little bit of ants here, so uh, yeah. That's how it is. And uh, I think I'll start with trying out with the... Um, not you, Cornelius, no? Trying out the alcohol, just to see how it works. So, um, I'll start by doing that. Yeah. And there's a sign here that said Max. So, uh, of course, I won't go over that. And adjust a little bit so I can try it out. I'll try it. Yep. Yeah, it's burning already. I don't think you can see it, but it's definitely burning. And that's the good thing with alcohol burner. Um, they don't get have any smoke and it's very clean burning. And now when it's um, warmed up, it will come up here and start burning through these little holes. Gonna take a little while. Yeah, and uh, I've got such one. We call them pulsehorn and means uh, sausage horns. Uh, it's just a sausage that is baked in a, a bread. Very delicious. It is used. Many parents are using that for for their children for school. But of course, also something. Green and I have a few. First, I'll try this one. Yep, and um, see here. Starting to come up through the holes, but you can't see it. Yeah. And uh, I have a few more. I'm ready. This done. I will uh, remove this uh, alcohol uh, insert and uh, find some twigs, and then I'll use it as a twig stove. Uh, as I said in the unboxing video, you can use it with coals and uh, wood pellets. I won't do that today. Uh, I don't have any wood pellets at the moment, um, and coals, yeah, it's good if it's long time um, cooking. But uh, this one is just fast, fast food. Yep. And uh, did you notice? I have my Essie knife back. Yeah, I love this knife. It's a real beast. Getting crispy. That is nice. Yeah. And now I think this one is finished. This just have to be warm, warmed up. It doesn't have to bake anymore. So uh, this one for putting out the fire. Like this, very easy. Yeah, and uh, I think I'll take my head off. It's really hot today. Yeah. You want some? And it is normally it doesn't like sausages. I'll give it a try. No, no, no. And again, I have to have him in lease. Um, 
there's also a lot of deer out here. And beside that, uh, some years ago I was out here and uh, you actually find a foxhole. I have a video where I talk about that and I'm afraid he will go down in the foxhole and what could then happen. Hmm? Hmm. Very nice. Hmm. Yeah. Then I'll take this one off. There's a little handle. There's a little handle here so we can take it without getting burned. But of course it's still hot. So I have to be careful Cornelius not touching it. Hmm, yeah. Right here. And then I just have to find some sticks. These sticks that I found here was very dry, so I think it's very easy to find some sticks. Now can it just you can always wait more. Yeah. So now it's Cornelius time to steal my sticks. <laughs> yeah. Very dry. It's so nice. This will burn very great. Yeah, it's burning nicely. And I can start preparing my coffee. Yeah, and you can see it's burning perfectly. These holes in the side are burning, and that's the gas uh, from the from the from the sticks uh, that is coming up of these holes. And then it has a very efficient burning. A great little stove here, I must say. For my coffee too. Yeah. That's 
that's the way to do it. And then some salt in. Kimber coffee. Put this over. I can take this off and uh, heat a little bit more. Yep. And it seems to be very efficient because it's almost boiling. I must say it's ultra fast, this little stove. But of course it has a big chamber. I could put a lot of firewood in and uh, yeah. Oops, that will do. And just let it rest. Where's my whiskey canoes? It's here. Mm. Take a look at the house, please. It's very hot on the outside. I can't hold it. Yeah. Great weather today.
gern tippen. Thing for you. No. <sighs> so yeah, now I'll try this little stove or big stove. Uh, they have a bigger uh, version of this, uh, like a bonfire. It's awesome, and uh, yeah. But go in and check them out. Uh, warm bond, uh, bond mini uh, stove, I think it is called. Bond mini stove is this called, and uh, yeah, it's really awesome. Um, the only thing, it's very hot, so I think it will take a while because it take a while before it's uh, cooled down as much, so I can put in the bag again. But uh, it's very efficient uh, and it burns really nice, really hot and really fast. So. Uh, I don't think I ever boiled water so fast uh, like today, uh, so this is very efficient. And also this little one for alcohol, I think it's great. Good, good uh, addition for such a stove and uh, yeah, I could recommend it. I definitely use it again. Uh, it's a little bit bigger than my solar stove, but that doesn't matter, it's only uh, 30% or so, so I can easily have it in my backpack and transport it. It's uh, still lightweight and uh, because it's so efficient, I can use it as a little bonfire too, to warm me uh, when I'm out in uh, the winter, in the cold months, uh, because it uh, produces a lot of heat here. So, yeah. Mm. Yeah, and I finally got my bracelet from uh, Not Finds with brass. I love it. It is so great. You can see here, good quality. And uh, along with this tomahawk from Fadir Tools, two items from Ukraine, they make some great stuff. Look at the closure here, isn't it cool? Yeah, folks. This is all for now from Cornelius and me out here in the beautiful forest. Just a short video to show you my new stove. And I think it's awesome. So uh, yeah, go in and check them out. I put a link in my video description. Of course I do that. And uh, yeah, there's a little lake uh, a little bit further away from here. And uh, when you go from this place, we'll go down 
the other lake and uh, see if I can uh, make some drone footage of that. It's very beautiful at this time of year. It's very uh, uh, muddy down there, so I can't, I can't go down to the lake, but with my drone I can show you the area where it is. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching Kimba Bushcraft. We really appreciate that. And then we hope to see you again in the next one. Bye bye. Take care. Oh. Mm -hmm.